do the Murray Des Moines, which is a ride from uh, Chuka to Port Ferry, 520 kilometres uh, in 24 hours. This year we decided that we um, had a lot of interest around doing the bike ride, so we thought we'd extend ourselves from 12 riders up to 24, so we're taking 25 people away this year. We'll ride out of uh, Chuka about 9, 9.15 on Saturday morning and we'll go out and do legs of 20 to 30 k's each and we keep leapfrogging like that the whole way down to Hamilton on the Saturday. We get in around midnight each year um, into the Hamilton showgrounds where we sleep in a cow shed on um, stretches and blow up beds, uh, just somewhere to rest the head for a few hours before we get up and take off again. Everyone has a great weekend, um, they all, everyone does a fantastic job fundraising for us um, and uh, yeah, I'm very thankful to them all for, for doing that. I love the camaraderie, I love you know the cause that we're doing it for, it's a challenge. I think the people that have got Huntington's have got more of a challenge than I have so it's you know a bit of pain doesn't hurt so you just go for it you know. Dad wanted to find a way to give back to Huntington's and to raise awareness and generate some funds to help other families. We saw the way that mum deteriorated, that, that um, it's, it's pretty tough the way they live and the needs that they have, special wheelchairs, um, even ramps for the house um, and just needing care constantly towards the, the latter stages of the Huntington. So our goal was to A, raise awareness of the disease and B, yeah, to just to try and help other families who are going through the same thing, just ease the burden for them. Everyone on this ride knows the hunters because we've got the best profile of the whole trip and there's you know probably 2,000 riders out there. The hunters have led the way in terms of how to raise awareness and funding for the community. The money raised has been essential to our emergency fund so we, we know each year the hunters will contribute to that fund and we're able to support people who are in crisis whether it's to do with accommodation or to keep them within their home. I would absolutely encourage people to donate to the hunters. Please be reassured that the donations that you give to the hunters actually assist Huntington's Victoria to provide essential support to the community.